Tell me, O muse, of the men who left France to do battle with the fierce feta of the Pindus Mountains. The trip started well. We were already in trouble with the Greek police within 45 minutes of leaving Athens after a little accident at the toll booth. The problem was no one had a license with them, so we had to search our computers and phones until we found a copy at the police station. Before we really get deep into the tzatziki, let me introduce to you who are these French heroes on this epic odyssey in the land of Homer. Antoine Baduel, an extra tech rider that slays spots like Persians, but can get a little angry sometimes. Maybe that's what makes the difference. Anto Bruto, a.k.a. La Poulpe, or the Octopus. He keeps it Shrek, always doing weird stunts. All smiles and up for a good laugh. <laughs> Remy is the best and the worst at the same time. The unpredictable always arises in his presence. He will make you laugh till your stomach hurts. A true Frenchman with the ladies. He is our trusty photographer, but make no mistake, this dude can shred. And me, the half French, half Greek filmer, translator, and poor excuse for a guide. Hello. After a few hours of jaw-dropping views, nothing was going to stop us from getting to Calavita. Nothing. Nothing. First day was windy on the hill, so a lot of the lifts were closed. But once we got there, we set up the spot, and the session was on. Lavrita was fun, but we decided to head north towards Vasilitsa that night. But before the crew could get very far out of the Peloponnesian Peninsula, the van broke. We didn't even know where we were. We didn't even know how long we were going to have to wait to fix the van. We weren't even sure if we were going to be able to snowboard anymore on this trip. Oula, 
ça passe ou pas